guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jensine, aka Jungle Naps. So today we're gonna be unboxing the March 2017 Ipsy Glam Bag. So I'm really excited. I feel like this bag just came really early. I usually get it towards the end of the month, so I am out of that. So amen to early delivery. <laughs> okay, so this is what the bag that it comes in looks like. And, you know, it always comes in the same little bag. Oh, it came with this cute little card. It says, pretty is as pretty does. Um, and then they usually have their hashtag that they share, which is hashtag ipsy, très joli. And then it just says, you are beautiful, pass it on. Which is really nice. I like the idea of, you know, spreading the self-love message around, you know. You can never get enough of that. So let's see what the actual bag looks like. Oh, this is kind of cute. Okay, so it's a different shape than the normal size. It's usually about like this big, you know? But I like that it's bigger. I always, I have so many of these, you guys. I love using them as little like travel storage pouches. They're just so good for that. But I really love the design. I think this is a really cute bag. I wish that it wasn't like all cottony cloth because I feel like it's just gonna get dirty easily but whatever that's not really that big of a deal let's open it up and see what we've got i haven't gone through this so i'm really really excited curl keeper okay now this is what i'm talking about so um this is from a brand called curl keeper it's the leave-in conditioner they give you about uh one fluid ounce of this and it's supposed to soften rough dry hair so okay this is what i'm feeling you know i could never have enough hair products especially since i have natural hair i'm always trying to find a way to keep it moisturized let's see on the back um it says it smooths and softens rough cuticles that are frizzy for flyaway hair it's a non-greasy formula and it doesn't cause buildup okay um i'm very 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 interested to try this out and see if it actually works well with my natural hair next up on the list this is from a brand called oh this is ico let me open this up for you guys Ugh, i'm out <sighs> okay cool <laughs> Ooh, so this is really cool it's their fat eye stick it's supposed to have a satin finish and it's got this really nice silvery color you know what it's like a silver beige i can't even decide what it is oh when it when you swatch it here you'll see it's definitely silver you can tell here this is actually really going to be nice for like a night out a nice smoky eye i haven't done like a silvery smoky eye in so long probably like a year Wow, oh, I can't wait to play with this. It's actually really pretty and it glides on so smoothly. Third on the list, there's something that feels like rubbery. Ooh, <laughs> okay. I like looked at it for a second like, what in the hell is this? Like, is this a weird like pimple popper? What is it? <laughs> Let me show you guys. First of all, I love that it comes in this cute little case to keep it nice and safe. And this is from a company called Chella. Look, it's a tweezer with an ergonomic little like pincher. This is so freaking cute, you guys. I love, I'm such an old lady, I love things that are like ergonomically correct. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> but um, this is amazing because I do have two tweezerman tweezers, but they're starting to get old and dull. And I just really don't want to repurchase them. So I'm really glad that they sent this because, you know, it's about getting time to tweeze the brows. So woohoo, I'm so excited. <laughs> this is probably like the best thing that I've received in an Ipsy bag. <laughs> Next up on the list, this is, oh, yes, I'm so excited. Okay, okay. This is from Tarte, it's their Tartiste Lip Paint. I have the color brownie originally, and this one is a villain. Oh my gosh, it is so beautiful, you guys. It's like a corally red. Ugh, let me just swatch this. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Especially because I have big lips, so you're really gonna be able to see this. It's so nice, like, ugh. and it's not, 
uh, dry yet, but it usually dries down to a matte finish. So I can't wait to wear this. I think this is so beautiful. Okay, so the final item in the bag. This is, oh, okay. This is from Pure. It's their Disappearing Ink 4-in-1 Concealer in the color Dark. I'm always a little bit leery of face products that come in subscription boxes, like, you know, foundations and concealers, because I'm like, oh God, like, it's just not gonna match, I know it. <laughs> but let's not jinx this, okay? I'm going in with an open mind. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna swatch this on my hand. Oh, okay, so far, so good. <gasps> no, you guys, I think we might have a match. <gasps> Actually, this is really, really pretty. Damn. Okay. Okay, Pure. Pure came for it. Pure really did come for it this month. They were not playing around. They were like, you know what? We finna get a whole bunch of new customers. Uh, I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. I love concealers. I have a thing for them. Like, I just keep buying them. I probably have two favorites currently right now, but I have, like, a good, like, 10 to 12 of them in my makeup stash. I don't know why, but I love them. So, um, I'm going to do my full face with this, and if I really like this, then, of course, I'm going to be purchasing the full size. Of course. So, all right, you guys, that's it for this month's Ipsy bag. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I did, like, really enjoy these products. I love them. I'm going to use all of them. There wasn't a single disappointing product that I got. So I just think that this bag keeps getting better and better. You know, I always review the items, and um, I'm not mad at any of the products I got. But I do want to know, if you subscribe to Ipsy, what you guys got, let me know down below in the comments. I always love to hear from you guys. So come back again soon. I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Bye!